Hi, I'm Ron Salyer. I'm president and CEO of Pioneer Electric Cooperative. I want to thank you for being a valued co-op member. Today, I want to cover two things with you. First is our local preparations for any winter weather activity uh, that may occur in our service area this year. As you know, you could have frigid temperatures, or you could have snow, ice, uh, lots of different weather can hit us at this time of year. The second thing I want to cover is concerns about the reliability of the electric grid that serves our area. So the electric grid serves 13 states in our region and we are a small part of the electric grid. Locally, you know, we're very well prepared. Pioneer is very well prepared for any winter issues that could affect our local operations. We've done a lot of preventive maintenance again this year. Tree trimming, we've done our tree trimming to keep trees away from the lines. We've been testing our poles to make sure that if poles are stressed by wind or ice that they will not break. We've replaced poles that are in danger of failing. We've also scanned our lines to look for weak points and we've fixed those weak points before the cold weather uh, gets to our area. On top of that, we've also have our Pioneer employees ready to go so they're ready to respond. We have our linemen ready to go 24 hours a day, you know, seven days a week. Our member service representatives are ready to answer the phone. And I really encourage you if we have winter weather and you see lines down to report that so we can prioritize uh, those outage conditions. Every year we also want you to be prepared because this winter storms can be unpredictable, can cause power lines to fail, and can cause longer than typical outages. So be, really be prepared in the event we have some you know, significant winter weather in our local area. The second thing I'd like to talk to you about today is the reliability of the regional electric grid in our area. It serves 13 states as well as Pioneer, and this is something new that we haven't really been concerned about too much in the past. What has changed is there's been demand for electricity increasing at a greater rate over the last few years. So that increase in demand with power plants being shut down is creating a condition where we could have some reliability challenges. Pioneer and the Ohio cooperatives were fortunate because we have power supply from our reliable uh, Cardinal coal-fired generation power plant. However, plants like our Cardinal plant are being shut down in the grid in our 13 state region. So these plants are being shut down at other utilities and that's causing this condition where we're concerned about the reliability of the 13 state regional grid. The North American Electric Reliability Council has been reporting that this increased demand for electric power as well as these generator retirements is causing an ever-increasing ever strain on the regional power grid. We've come to expect reliability for the last several years with our grid, but now that's being challenged. In addition, other grids outside of our 13 state region in the South have been experiencing rolling blackouts in the last couple of years. Ohio has seen this strain on the grid just recently as Christmas of 2022. In Christmas time of 2022, we were really close to having to implement rolling blackouts due to the strain on the regional electric grid. In some southern states, they actually had to do rolling blackouts for their consumers. This year, we could face these challenges again. This would not just be for members of Pioneer, but this would affect all electric consumers, including investor-owned utility consumers and municipal electric consumers. We're hopeful that this will not be the case, but we think it's really important that everybody's aware that this is something new that you need to be prepared for here this winter and into the future. If the grid has issues, we may need you to reduce electricity this winter. If we need you to reduce electricity, you're going to see social media posts and media stories about the need to reduce your power. If this step isn't enough, the next step would be for Pioneer and all the other utilities to implement rolling blackouts where we disconnect your power for a four hour time period or so 
to relieve the strain on the electric grid. We will be doing this with all other utilities to do our part to keep the grid stable. To wrap this up, I want to just let you know that we are ready for storm related outages here at the local level. Our crews are ready to go. Our member service representatives are ready. If we do have local storms, I'm very confident that we're gonna respond well, just like we have for several years. But the new item that we wanna be prepared for is the potential for regional reliability grid issues. So just be prepared. And I want everybody to understand that this could happen at any time. Always remember, Pioneer will do everything possible to keep the lights and the heat on. No matter the challenges, safety's first, safety of you, our members, as well as our employees. So safety is going to guide all of our decisions during any challenging situations that come up. I really want to thank you for being a part of Pioneer Electric Cooperative.